Okay. Hey guys, Lindsay with Empower Movement Physical Therapy. So I want to show you one of my favorite taping techniques. If you're having some painful shoulders, oftentimes when your shoulder hurts, you'll feel it on the very front part of the shoulder or kind of on top, but it's a little bit deep. Oftentimes what can cause that pain is something called impingement, where you're actually pinching the tissue or the rotator cuff inside of the shoulder joint. So what oftentimes happens, because we have such a forward um, oriented way of going about the world with typing and using our phones and stuff, our arm bones tend to migrate forward and you'll get more pinching of the structures on the front side of your shoulder. And so what I want to do is a taping technique to actually take that arm bone and pull it backward. Another thing too that will often help with this is taking the actual shoulder blade itself and pulling it down and back. You have a bump on top of your shoulder blade called your acromion that if you take your shoulder blade and you pull it back like that, it moves the acromion out of the way and gives your arm bone a little bit more room so stuff isn't pinching. So if you're having trouble with overhead work when you're at the gym or like holding your kids and holding them on either side and getting that front sided shoulder pain, this is a really good taping technique for you. So we're using two types of tape here. One is a cover roll, which basically is just a cloth tape that helps protect your skin. And then we're gonna be using Luco tape, which is a super rigid strapping tape. So um, it's much more rigid than the tape that you see like on like the Olympic athletes. That's kinesio tape, totally different kind of tape, totally different application. Luco tape is meant for holding, that one's not gonna work. Luco tape is meant for <clears throat> like stabilization and holding stuff down. This is stuff is like super rigid and it's also waterproof. So um, for like you swimmers and triathletes out there, this is a really good type of tape for you. And what you tape down is not going to move. So I tell people when I tape you, this tape will last you about two days um, or more if you're not much of a shower person. So shower, that's a good thing. Okay, so the first piece of tape is gonna go right over the top of the shoulder. So right where the upper trapezius is, this big muscly thing, we wanna trap that and pull that down. Make sure all hair is out of the way or it's gonna pull the first time you move your head. And the white tape, you just lay it down. That's a protective layer and it should go the length of your shoulder blade and if it goes a little bit extra, well, that's some extra, no big deal. Then just smooth that down. The next piece goes on the side of the arm. So this is where we're taking that arm bone, your humerus, and pulling it back. So, but this white piece is just laying down so that we have a good surface for the Luco tape to stick to. So we're gonna be just a little bit in front. You don't want it too far down the arm, otherwise you'll never be able to reach in front of you. So this is as low as I would go. Make sure you can see the crease of the person's armpit and then just lay the tape down. So basically what I'm doing is creating a like V shape right where the shoulder blade is because that's what we're trying to hold down. Then we get the Luco tape, which is our like super sticky stuff. That's gonna lay right over the top of where the white tape is. But what I'm gonna have you do, Natalie, if you can squeeze your shoulder blades together and down, awesome. So this is also a really good postural taping because it holds you back. You're gonna take that piece of tape, anchor it down with one hand and then pull down. So you wanna get some of the skin puckering and then fasten it down. Now, like I said before, this tape is super rigid. So initially it's gonna feel like you're gonna have some trouble moving your arm, but once you move around a little bit, the tape will give some and you'll be able to move no problem. So just give it a couple hours and you'll feel totally fine. So then we're gonna come back again with that arm. We're pulling it back, we're getting a little wrinkling right there, that's what we wanna see, a little skin cleavage. And then rub it down and that's it. So oftentimes I will tape both shoulders just because it feels kind of funky having this one shoulder pulled back and the other one's like super free. So even if the other shoulder's not bothering, oftentimes I'll tape the other one just so that you feel like it's even. So give it a try and let me know how it goes. Thanks guys.